I'm here at Chun Li High School and I'm not here to retake my GCSEs, I'm here for some Taekwondo. Now technically, I'm pretty intimidated because I'm the weakest one here. Taekwondo is one of, the, one of the biggest martial arts in the world and uh, actually in the UK it's absolutely massive. Our association has uh, 25,000 members with approximately 600 schools, so all over the UK we're branched to, to train. So how is Taekwondo different to like Judo, Karate and all the other judo. martial arts? Different to judo, massive difference because we don't grapple on the floor and we don't have any throws or holds, so we're all kicking and punching martial arts. So very similar to your stand-up fighting martial arts. How did you got one of them? You've got a world champion down here too. Uh, the young man standing over the back, and again, you'll get to see him in a minute. I mean, we've got some pretty good fighters here anyway, so we can't just focus on one man. Some of our juniors are fantastic. Well, my son had a friend at primary school who was doing Taekwondo here, and he said to my son, Andrew, why don't you go? So I brought him one evening and sat at the side and watched. And then Mr. Lutwich said, well, why don't you have a go? So I thought, well, all right. I've kind of fancied having a go at a martial art, but never knowing what to do. And I did, and we've we both come now. Um, we've been coming since 2003, and lately my husband started. Now he's in his 50s, so it doesn't mean to say that you're, it's ever too late to start. So the people who are reluctant to like come to this, towards this kind of event, what would you tell them? I tell them it's a really friendly place to come, and don't feel that you can't do anything, because you start. Everybody starts at the basics, and you work your way up slowly. There's no pressure on you to ever grade you can take one step at a time and it's great for fitness, it's great for self-defense, especially for kids. You hear about bullying in school, it's great to know they can defend themselves if they need to. So I've got to say congratulations because um, me and you are the same age and I'm just standing here with a mic and you're out there kicking some butt. So when did you start um, this Taekwondo? Um, I started when I was seven, that's when I really started. Then I took a couple of years out, you know, my dad had a car crash and that and then I started back when I was 14 years old, that's when I started grading. Then I didn't start fighting until I was 15 years old. So why did you get involved with Taekwondo? Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan's my hero. So <laughs> after watching his films and seeing all the kicking and stunts, I just I see Taekwondo add in the paper and just joined. Um, I suppose you got you know have like a discipline. You're not allowed to be able to. I mean, there's only like restrictions that you've got to hold back on. Yeah, there's not um, so much like we have to is well we do have to but it's not that hard like obviously we wouldn't go out clubbing like weeks before months before a tournament you know we wouldn't eat like certain foods you no know, fizzy pop and you know a lot of training so it's hard for the social life as well so, so tell us a bit about your next tournament um, next tournament is in croatia so which will be i'll be fighting for england so we'll be sent over there that is on a third of may and so, yeah, it's for the World All-Stars Tournament, which I, last year I won, so try and defend that again this year. Taekwondo looks like an awesome, powerful, energetic sport, and I'm hoping all the white belts here become black belts one day. I'm Christian O'Coley, reporting for Local News TV.